today is Friday, November 27th, aka Black Friday, which means tomorrow is Small Business Saturday. So I thought it would be very fitting to take a look at some wholesale vendors who are more on the small business side. A lot of these are going to be mom and pops who work out of their own homes, probably like a lot of you guys. And a lot of the products that they're going to sell aren't necessarily clothing items, but there'll be other items that you could carry in your boutique if you're interested. So if you haven't seen our video on where to find wholesale clothing vendors, I will link to that down below because today we are looking at a wide array of other types of wholesale products. So what happened was I was stumbling across my Facebook feed and I saw a post in one of the business groups I'm in where someone actually said, I'm starting a new boutique. Can you guys all share your links to your wholesale products? I thought it would be fun to just read off these items to you and I will actually share my screen as I do it. So I'm going to go ahead and click record on my iPhone so you guys can follow along as we go through these products. Okay, so the first one is I sell natural bath and body products, Wilson Farm soaps. So if you're looking for bath and body products, this would probably be a great place to take a look. Next, we have someone who sells fake genuine leather earrings. Um, she says all sizes and styles. And her website is, or actually her Facebook group is Cabinet Maker's Daughter. So if you're interested in finding leather or faux leather earrings, check out her Facebook group for more information. Next we have someone saying, have you ever considered paparazzi accessories? You buy them for $2.75 and sell them for $5. So I've actually never heard of that vendor, but could be worth checking out. And I do want to pause and say that all of these vendors that I'm reading off to you guys today, I haven't actually purchased from them, so I can't verify the quality or the fit. So what I always recommend is try to see if you can read their reviews before purchasing from them. And you could probably send them a couple emails and See if they'd be willing to share some references if you can't find any reviews. All right, so the next one is I own Dude Supply Co. If you're interested in men's toiletry bags, scratch made beard oil and butter and men's accessories. So that sounds like a very interesting one to take a look at. Next, someone linked to their Etsy store and it looks like she sells 100% pure soy wax candles and wax melts. Another person listed FAIR is a great place to get items, so of course we already know about FAIR. The next one is Hand Embroidered Jewelry. Um, she says it's very popular amongst her boutique, it's very popular amongst boutique owners, and she links to it here. So she has SaboDesignOfficial.com. We also have someone who's offering to sell some of their spring items. I'm sure that person bought them at wholesale and probably got stuck with them now that it's winter. I also see one for Oily, oily Blends Wholesale. She's on Fair, Fashion Go, and Orange Shine. Next, I see someone who says, I am crafting homestead. I do a lot of different crochet items that I could do at wholesale. She makes crochet chapstick holders, faux leather bows. We have one person who says, I have lots of beautiful jewelry, crystals, acrylics, and pearls. So she wants you to reach out to her directly if you're interested in those. Next, I have one that says, we wholesale our handmade inspirational leather and cork jewelry to retailers all over the country. And the website for that is createhopecuffs.com. Oh, and it looks like they have a popular holiday kit for two different price points. 
Next, I have someone who says, I design and sell handbags, wallets, and cosmetics. Would love to wholesale them. Her website is yorkandgrace.com. Next, we have someone who is a faith-based brand with a little mom sass. All original products and designs. Her website is fox and whole, foxandowlwholesale.com. Next, I have someone who linked to a website called Beehive Soap and Body Care. Some more Bath and Body products. And then another one that is Live Simple, Live Simple, Simple Soap. Live Simple, Simple Soap.com. Handcrafted soap, beeswax, candles, and gift sets. Next, we have what about options of products that all give back? You could become an affiliate with DVTD and sell over 300 products, all which give back to dozens of causes all over the world. You make at least 25%. So I'm not familiar with that. I would just want to make sure that it's not a um, multi-level marketing company. All right, so the next one is lotions, lotion candles made in South Carolina, creativeenergycandles.com. We also have someone else who owns a handmade soap and lotion company with body products. We have a paw and snout for pups. The name of that is Soap and More. Next, we have someone who has a wholesale made in the USA sock brand. And then the link to that is ggsocks.com. Next, we have another person offering to clear out their inventory. Another person who has a full storage up for sale from a boutique. We have someone who offers girls dresses they haven't done wholesaling yet but they're thinking about it um looks like it's made on etsy handmade children's clothing dear elizabeth company we have someone who has purple thumb lavender bath and body products it looks like the website is purplethumblavender.com Next, we have someone who also sells baby and children's clothing. And the website is shop.blessingbymyside.com. Next, we have a handmade beaded jewelry company. We have someone who says, my friend has an alpaca ranch and sells amazing things. Dryer balls, scarves, gloves, etc. All from alpaca fiber. And the name of that is Urban Alpacas. Um, we have another person who's offering, I believe, soaps. And the name of the company is Big Red Barn, Big Red Barn Goat Milk Soap. Someone says, are you interested in selling athleisure? And she's suggesting a company called Savvy, S-A-V-V-I. Um, it's a new company, still in pre-launch, but you can purchase wholesale. Next, we have someone who says, I sell unique earrings wholesale, but you can PM them for more information. Next, I have theleatherdrop.com. It looks like quality, lightweight leather earrings. Next, we have, I have a huge wholesale biz. All items are handmade. Licked, or is it L-I-C-T, wholesale, hand, wholesale hand-stamped jewelry, candles, lip balms, and more. Next, we have wholesale boys' clothing and customized t-shirts from Be Free Threads. We have someone who sells homemade Play-Doh kits for kids, and that's from neatdough.com. 
Next, we have someone linking to the Vintage Sparrow. But they don't specify what it is. Next, we have graphic tees and sweatshirts from MalertApparel.com. Next, we have someone who links to all natural handcrafted herbal products from Three Sister Three Sisters Herbals.com. Next, we have someone who says they make 3D signs and ornaments out of wood and acrylic from HJ Rustic Wholesale. We have someone who says they have a jewelry and friendship jars business. And the website is embrace.com slash shop. We have another person offering to clear out their inventory from their own boutique. We have Tundra Wholesale Marketplace, tundra.com. We have one person who says they sell paper goods for the home. Currently our only are three by five freestanding calendars. If you're interested, that is the Fika collective.com. We have another person who has wholesale McCrame earrings, wall hangings, Christmas ornaments, and more. Also offer wholesale woven wall hangings that she makes from my farm where I raise sheep. We have one person who says, check out Lyric Glass on Instagram. Um, next, we have someone offering mommy and me and daddy and me items. And that is from thedeltapearl.com. We also have someone offering custom orders at bulk discount from fragrance, fragrancesofeden.square. Next, I have someone who sells bottle cards for wine, liquor, gift giving, and they sell on Etsy. Another person saying become an affiliate with DVTD. So that's that one. Oh, it's supposed to be devoted. So that's one of the ones that was mentioned earlier. I wonder what that company is all about. have someone who has jbokebarrel.com and it looks like it's handcrafted goods out of Orlando. Next, someone is linking to Claudia, Claudia Darmiento.shop. It looks like clothing. Someone else is offering the Smells Good. They make hand poured candles and air fresheners. Next we have anchored soldesigns.com slash wholesale request. So I wonder, not sure what type of products those would be though. Um, someone else is offering function herbal teas and first aid body care products. Maintain your brain. Here we have someone just posting their website, RC Designs. Doesn't tell me what they sell. Someone sells Heidi socks wholesale. They're liner socks that won't slip off your feet because they have an ankle strap designed with genuine crystals. Interesting. Next, I have someone who is wholesaling lashes, hair, and shoes, but it doesn't list the company. Next, we have two chicks in Texas wholesale. I'm assuming that's... Okay, so it says screen printed tea starts at $7. Um, next, we have someone who has... is linking to a website called Project Joanne once again, doesn't say what they're selling. Now I see someone that says, Wild About You Boutique VIP. 
graphic tees and bleached flannels and more. So I would double check to make sure that they're offering those at wholesale, I'm not just linking to their VIP Facebook group. Um, next we have savinggracehair.com, so probably hair products. Um, someone who sells art and create boutique items from my art. It's interesting. Someone saying that they have some clothes at wholesale. They do not provide a link. We have someone who does fun, fun decals from Maddie J and Co. Next we have someone who sells aprons and tea towels wholesale. Also jewelry and that is Humboldt Tart Oh, it's hard to say all these. Humboldtartisangroups.com But that doesn't look like the same website. The website looks like amysalmostperfect.com So maybe she has two groups. It looks like two websites. Next we have I sell handmade leather and metal wire jewelry. She has an Etsy shop. Next we have I have a mom and me apron that I'm selling wholesale. I also see one for interior items and kid-friendly stuff. And that's an Etsy shop. Next we have, I make teethers, blankets, burp cloths, and crochet hats. That's sewcrochet.com. Next, we offer children's clothes and adult shirts wholesale, gingersnapwishes.com. We're almost done here. So the next one is, I also have wine tumblers. It's probably one of the same people. Yep, so coffee mugs coming soon. She has an Etsy website listed. I hand make baby accessories. All, I all items in my shop meet CPSC safety requirements. And that is beatsprout.com. I have a line of Italian leather handbags and small leather goods I design, make from scratch and wholesale. And then lastly, we have modern crochet and knit accessories from Darling Mountain. And that's it, that's the whole list. So I know this video was a little bit unusual, but I thought it would be kind of fun, especially if you guys are interested in shopping small wholesalers especially on shop small business Saturday. So um, let me know if you guys enjoyed this type of video. Um, if so, I'd be happy to do this again because I do see posts like this all the time in all of these Facebook groups I'm in. Um, but I hope you guys have a great holiday um, and I will see you on the next video.